Hi guys, I'm back with a new video. So today I'm gonna do a teaser trailer came out for the Ghostbusters, a new Ghostbuster movie. So I'm gonna give my thoughts on the trailer. So so let's start. Frozen Empire Ghostbuster. So yeah, this is the sequel from Afterlife. Afterlife was a brilliant film, well made. Brilliant. Huge fan of the Ghostbusters. So yeah, let's go and see. Let's uh, talk about the trailer. The trailer dropped in yesterday. Yeah, so let's start. Ghostbusters ain't afraid of ghosts, but they are scared of extreme. So climate change. In the teaser trailer for Ghostbusters Frozen Empire, the latest installment in the ghost fighting franchise, the sequel to 2021's Ghostbusters Afterlife, which I liked and enjoyed. The new cast as well, Paul Rudd and your Egon's daughter as well. Yeah, so they had some good new cast in, in that Ghostbuster after 11. Plus the cameo of a late great Raymond. Yeah, Raymond. Who played Egon. You know what I mean, Doctor. Yeah, they had a, a cameo of him. Yeah, which the film touched. Had good uh, actors as well, like the original cast as well came back. Bill Murray and Dana Crowd. So yeah, in the trailer we saw, I saw, so Bill Murray, the original cast from the original Ghostbusters, and Ernie Hudson as a uh, yeah Winston. So this is story continues from the left up on the um, afterlife. So which into, in, in, introduced a new protein pa uh, packing team featuring Paul Rudd, Yad Finn, Wolfhard and Kari Goon returns the franchise to New York where the not a silly hot summer day is uh, overtaken by a cold front that literally freezes people to death in Ghostbuster Frozen Afterlife. So is that New York main thing is frozen. That building thing with a Ghostbusters uh, favorite, famous place like in the 80s and all that. Yeah, that's the show is all frozen and all that. Good to see this cast returning, Paul Rudd and the team in the new film sequel. So it's looking very promising. So features Paul Rudd, like I said, Finn Wolfhard and Carrie Coon return the franchise in the New York City where uh, her motorily, motorily hot summer in overtaken by cold frost that literally freezes people to death in Ghostbusters Frozen Empire. The Spegler family return to where it all started. The icons New York City Firehouse to team up with the original Ghostbusters like Bill Murray and Hedy Hudson who have developed in the top secret research lab to take Busting ghosts to the next level. Sony Pictures said in a synopsis, sick, but when the discovery of a ancient antric unleashes an evil force, Ghostbusters new and old must join forces to protect their home and save the world. So uh, yeah, from a, se a second ice age, whereas after life 
Oli teased the participation of the old Ghostbuster crew in trailers. So their involvement wasn't confirmed until audience actually saw the movie, which was Afterlife, which I enjoyed was the best in the franchise. Frozen Inspire is upfront that Bill Murray, Dan Aykroyd and Ernie Hudson all return in this film. So that's good original versus new cast. So that's fantastic. I'm a huge Ghostbusters fan. Like I said. So yeah. So as a old return. So that's good. The Legends return man. For the latest chapter. So this is another latest chapter by Sony. So this is the sequel to Afterlife. So uh, looking promising. Which was directed by Gil Cannon and uh, co-written by Jason Rentman, director of Afterlife and son of a original Ghostbusters director the, um, who made the film, Ivan Rentman, who made the f uh, first two original films back in the day. McKenna Grace, Logan, Kim and Celestan O'Connor also reprised the Afterlife roles. Yeah, so good to see these cast back in the new uh, uh, film. While Patton Oswear and Kuna, Kunal Nanja Jad, if I pronounced that correctly, yeah. So this is the new cast will be in the new film. So yeah, join the cast for this adventure hitting. So the film hitting theaters on March 29. 2024 which is next year so yeah good to see the, the new suits they wearing new pro suits the red new suits Paul Rudd got a different look as well he looks he looks cool and all the all the the cars looking good with those red new suits and they have the protein uh, packs and all that get ready to blast the ghost so yeah it's looking another good sequel by seeing the teaser and trailer and uh, I forgive my thoughts on the the new Ghostbuster sequel. Because Afterlife I enjoyed. It was fantastic and well made. And uh, yeah, it was a fantastic film. And uh, I'm happy they're making another one. By Sony Pictures made an, making a new film which is coming out next year. So yeah, we have to see what happens in the film. All the scenes that showed Frozen and Ecto-1 came out and all the Bill Murray entrance and uh, Ernie Hudson entrance as well. Yeah, it's looking promising. I like those, the best thing about it, I like those new suits they're wearing, the red one. Yeah, yeah, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed the original films as well, guys, and, uh, and Afterlife. 2016 film was okay. I wouldn't say the best Ghostbuster film, but they did what they did. That's my opinion. But uh, this is looking promising. I think they will go well with the sequel. I, I, if this film succeeds next year at the box office, I hope they make a third part as well of this seek in in the series in the franchise of the Ghostbusters. I love to gr grown up watching the real Ghostbusters back in the day. Who you gonna call? Ghostbusters. I loved I loved Ghostbusters growing up as a kid watching Ghostbusters and those uh, 1984 Ghostbusters and uh, the Ghostbuster 2 was decent as well. When they go on this uh, Statue of Liberty. Yeah, and Marshmallow Man. So yeah, it's looking promising. So yeah, the trailer was decent. So I'll give it 3.5. Uh, I'm happy that they're going to have Bill Murray in this as well. All the original cast, Dan Aykroyd as Ray, Ernie Hudson as, uh, yeah, as returning as well, as Winston, Bill Murray as Dr. Peter Wegman. Yeah, it's fantastic. This is into the next level of Ghostbuster franchise, next level of uh, filmmaking, and is going to be a 
Frozen uh, Empire and the title goes there because it goes well with the title got to show all the frozen icy ice age kind of yeah sequence they showed in the teaser trailer so yeah i'm looking forward to watching this film and yeah looking very promising yeah <clears throat> only the ghostbuster 2016 was okay for me don't get me wrong it was okay for them I love the original films. Sigourney Weaver was in the films as well. When she protects that baby from that ghost. That was the second film. Ghostbusters 2 back in the day. Yeah. I love the Ghostbuster franchise very much. I love the Ghostbuster uh, franchise. Huge fan of the Ghostbuster fran franchise. Myself. And uh, yeah. I'm happy they're making another one and the teaser dropped for give my thoughts on it. So yeah, it's looking promising. Afterlife was a well-made film and I uh, enjoyed the original cast came back in the series. So it's just fantastic, man. Uh, yeah, and good to see actor one. Brilliant, man. Brilliant teaser trailer for Ghostbusters. Frozen Empire. So yeah, I love that. So yeah, let's see when another full trailer comes out. I give my thoughts on the full trailer as well. And uh, yeah, let's see. Hope it clicks with the audience and they like it as well. Like the Ghostbusters Afterlife came out in 2021, which I uh, was a adorable film. Yeah. I remember I picked it up on Asda when it came out first day. I remember that uh, they only had one copy. This lady looked for it. It didn't have it on the shelves, but uh, she managed to have it. I managed to pick it up on the release date. Yeah. So, yeah, uh, I enjoyed Afterlife. So, the sequel is looking promising into the next level. So, yeah. Fantastic. The Ghostbusters Frozen Empire gets for me 3 out of 5. We'll see when the film comes out and uh, hope the audience and uh, myself click the story and the film and the cast. And then the good, I'm going to hope to see Slimer as well coming back and uh, we'll see what happens. Time will tell. So Ghostbusters Frozen Empire gets for me honest 3.5 stars for a teaser trailer. Yeah. Sony, I think Sony will do well with the picture. Sony pictures looking promising for a film. So yeah, I'm looking forward to this film next year. It's on March 29, 2024. So yeah. Hope you like, subscribe and share. And this is my honest teaser trailer talk about the film teaser trailer reaction yeah it was looking good they can't go wrong with the franchise like i said they can't go wrong it's looking promising i i, I like it as far as the show and the teaser trailer yeah let's we'll see when the full film comes out and the full proper trailer comes out give my thoughts on it and uh yeah stay tuned for that whenever it comes out so we have till March, so we have in, we in November, yeah. So November, December, Jan, Feb, March. So yeah. Looking forward to this film. In the year 2024. And I will definitely pick this film as well. Like as I have all the Ghostbuster films. I have the first two films. And I have uh, Ghostbuster 2016 and Afterlife. So yeah, very happy that the Ghostbuster movie is coming out next year. Very decent trailer. I'm gonna like it. I hope it clicks to everyone and the film does well at the box office. Huge success. Yeah, I hope it succeeds. That's what I want for this film to uh, franchise to go forward. We we'll see where they take it forward. The makers, time will tell. So hope you like, subscribe and say, share. Stay safe, play safe. And I will see you in the next video.
बाय